Pat from Bad Save Music. Thank you for joining me for another video. And yes, this is the Arrhythmics, Here Comes the Rain Again. But so many great songs are by this band, so please check them out if you haven't heard of them before. Arrhythmics, so many amazing, amazing songs. So diving right on in, let's check this song out. So how each sort of verse begins and the intro sort of begins is you hear this chord. <laughs> Now I'm going to show you a hard way to play it and then an easier way to play it. That sounds a little bit different, but we'll still get you there. Now the most important thing is you're up strumming. So not a down strum, you're doing an up strum to get that sound. And you're sort of hearing the different strings there. You're not just, not just all at once. So what you want to do is you want to have your first finger on the second fret of the second string. You then want to skip up and have your second finger on the second fret of the fourth string. Then you want your pinky, and this is the really tricky part, you want your pinky on the fourth fret of the third string. And then you strum up. Now if that's too tricky, I will show you an easy way. So throughout the entire song, if you hear me say A minor, this is the particular A minor I'm talking about. A minor at nine. But if that's too tricky, all I want you to do is take your pinky off and this time have your first finger and then your third finger and then your second finger above that. So you're playing a regular A minor chord instead. And if that's easier, hey, start with that and then build up to the other one. Great. Now the entire song, there's a lot of sort of space going on in this song. So maybe if you were playing it or you were playing along with the recording or you were singing, maybe strum once per sort of line of lyrics. Maybe have a little bit of chorus and echo and flange like what I've got on. To give it a big sort of dreamy sound and then maybe build in some strums later on. But so the entire song is based around these sort of chords. You've got A minor to begin with. Again, you can do this A minor. Or you can do this A minor, it's up to you. And then over to F, and then G, and then A minor again. And that's it. So it starts off at the beginning. Here comes the rain again, and then F, falling on my head like a memory, then G, falling on my head like a A minor, new motion. And then it could start off again. I wanna walk in the open wild F Wanna talk like lovers do G Wanna dive in the ocean A minor, is it A minor with you? So that's the entire verse. Every verse of the song repeats that same thing. So well done, I'd say you're about halfway there. So then you'd say it's the sort of pre-chorus chorus. Starts on F. So baby, F, talk to me like C lovers do and baby F like C do and then F again like C and then over to D G so that entire chorus is F C F C F, C, D, G. And then it just repeats again for the verse. Here comes the rain again, raining on my head like a tragedy, tearing but like a motion. And then it just repeats the entire thing. Now the only other part of this song that we haven't covered, so we've covered all the verses, we've covered the choruses, is this sort of weird instrumental sort of breakdown where it's, there's no lyrics going on. So let's check out that. So for that, it's E minor, F, A minor, then the second time it's E minor, F, G. And then it's straight back into the so baby and then F like C do F me like C do and then G. And that's it. That's the entire song. You've learned the whole thing. Well done. But so many amazing songs um, they've written over the years. So definitely go back and check them out. And thank you so much for watching. Any other questions, hit me up on Facebook or on Instagram or comment below. Otherwise, I'll see you in a few days for another video. Okay.